I've made it a little over halfway. It's about four o'clock in the morning, and I'm uh, pretty well torched from driving right now. So I'm going to try and sleep here. Just a half hour, I think. I'll probably do her. Then get back on the road again, put some gas in. It's about that time for gas, anyways. So. same piece that I was in last year and uh, where I seen a couple of my better box and uh, I pretty well knew it was since I got off the road. The, they obviously switched it this year and there's uh, there's been cattle in here. There's still cattle in here now so um, I don't necessarily think it's a I still don't think it's a true like they don't like being around cattle. It has more to do with that just the amount of grass that's grown is a lot different than what there is, you know, where there aren't cattle all summer. It's really obvious just to the south of here <clears throat> where the fence line is, where the cows were last year. Um, now you can look at that south side and that grass is, you know, significantly taller, you know, looks a little greener, like there's just simply more grass there. So I've just been kind of picking my way back through here. I did see a couple of decent bucks off the private, um, really tucked into cedar trees, but um, I don't I don't think there's any reason for them to come off the private there's no cattle in there on that piece so I don't see why they would cross and come into this here so I'm gonna just keep kind of keep working my way out and, and I'm gonna probably come in from the south uh, now that I've seen this coming from the south tomorrow morning and, and probably hike in a little ways and and take a peek
Well, it concludes day two. Dakota's actually on his way out here right now. Um, so I got some cameras out this morning for the whitetail stuff. And then uh, I've seen some great deer this morning again. So hopefully tomorrow, uh, maybe find some to go to bed. I can chase one at noon, but realistically, probably hang out here and bake in the sun for a while. It's supposed to be hot again tomorrow, so uh, it'll be another late afternoon deal, but hopefully we get something on the cameras. I haven't really figured anything out to put cameras out for the mule deer, so just got them on a field edge for white tails, and hopefully something comes up with that there. So, potatoes on, chickens on. I'm excited for potatoes tonight. <laughs> I kind of neglected them last night, so yeah it's gonna be good <laughs> and it's windy holy cats is it windy go to the big one do you smell it or something we can get him uh, you know find him make sure he's still in there and well, you get a you get on a stock or stock him not, even if he's not like in a spot to get on him and kill him where he's laying but there's only one direction out of there yeah if they're gonna do what they've been doing yeah Trying to send a few arrows before we head in. See what's shaking here. afternoon heading into where we uh, put that group of bucks to bed here this morning and uh, yeah the winds good now um, and I figured out where they laid down in a little bit of a if you want to say a short steep pocket we're gonna try and take a look and see if we can if we can make a play on them right now but if not I feel like I guess I'm pretty confident they'll come back out the way they came in they did about the same routine last night and the morning before. They bedded on that side and they come back to where I guess we always see them in the morning. So confident they'll come back through in which we got a pretty good pinch point to get on. <clears throat> but I guess, I don't know. They got to do the right thing and we got to do our right thing too.
I heard him crash in his right now. That was him going down. Clearly needed that one last little push. When you scout, you put all that time in. Yeah, put an awful lot of time in. A lot of miles, a lot of gas. <sighs> one thing is for sure, when you set your mind to something, especially a deer like that, you're gonna <laughs> kill it. <laughs> There's no talking you out of that. I don't blame you.
Oh, sweet Jesus. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh my. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Dude. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> oh. Split ear. Got a, got a cheater over here. Oh wow. Oh my goodness. Dude. <laughs> Oh man, this is unreal. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is unreal. I, I gotta set this camera up. I gotta, I gotta touch them. Let's do it. Oh man, let's go to bed. Actually, you know what? No, we got a lot of let's go do. celebrate. <laughs> Even his friend a is. Big giant piece of gold in there. <laughs> it's like caked in with all this freaking dust. I just eat them. It helps clean my teeth, all that dirt. Yeah, <laughs> yeah what's the dirt in there? Strawberry wine. Stepping. Let's take a dip in the strawberry river. Come on, let's go.